Start scrubbing your boob, Morgan. Cor Hello guys and welcome to GTA 5 live commentary of this crazy modding turbine thing that appears to be going on over here. And we have Howling Westy and Knowing Toast. Say hello. Yeah. Hi. So, uh, so we didn't mod this thing guys, we actually went into a random session and this was already here. Yeah. So this seems a pretty crazy glitch, so as you can see, it seems to give some crazy launch scenarios. So we were trying to do a launch guy. glitch prior to this, but Look at I basically this joined a random session and found this right outside the starting gate. So I was like, okay. Oh, it's automatically putting me in the other Mini Cooper. All right, let's go. Look at this. Yeah, I think I'm gonna try and get in here. Let's see if I can get... Whoa! Um, um, I think my car's a little bit broken, guys. Um, <laughs> okay, it won't even move now. What the hell is going on over there, Scott? Seriously. I have no idea. The cops are here now. I made, I made it through anyway. I don't even think the cops know what to do. They're just stood there like, what the hell is going on over here? If you guys are wondering why I'm not in the game, um... I'm kind of stopping around at Knowing Toe's house at the moment, so... Yeah, so, so, they're, so they're recording together, basically. Oh, and yeah, just so sharing one account. It in turns on his profile. I'm, all right, so I'm getting in this Albany Emperor, He's come on. One minute. Alright, the Albany Emperor driver's driving away. Maybe this Mini Cooper guy's gonna stop. Maybe it's not. No... Nope, come on. Right, I'm gonna shoot you now. Playing, guys. I, I just killed the driver of the Mini Cooper. So Corey, what do you think what do you think of this crazy turbine launch glitch type thing? I think this is the funniest thing that's ever happened to me in GTA. I mean this thing has sort of happened before. Not with turbines, but that sign over there about buying the house. That just duplicated itself over and over again. What the hell is going on over there? I just saw the turbine hit you with your dead body go flying. I don't get it why people hack the game though. I hate hackers, but it's so Except when they do fun things. Yeah. We, yeah, we, we found that out earlier. How did we Scott's like, I hate hackers, but then he absolutely loves it when oh, a glitch like this happens. How did we... What the hell? <laughs> uh, what? Your body just we bounced got... into me. Have we got that... infinite health? No, we haven't got god mode. I wish we had, but unfortunately, no, no, we're not the hackers. We like, fell, we like fell like a million feet in the air. Slight exaggeration there. And then we, f then we like fell, fell. And Whoa! Then he even kill us. Yeah, it's it's not when Ethan did his glitch about GTA 5, and then um, like he would be launched like how many, th it's like really far into the air and wouldn't. D like Don't die. See. It take damage but not die. Oh wow, we got the cops on us now. It's not very good. Popo, stay cool. I think I think I think because of all this stuff happening, like when I had my Rhino tank guys that I called out earlier, the game was so laggy when the, when the Rhino tank was here. Holy Did you crap! See that go into like a rage thing? Yeah. Oh, I'm now the driver of the car apparently. Right, I think I'm gonna go and take this over the Emperor to the uh, the turbine just to see if I. Because I know the first time I did this, I went under the map. Very far. Yeah, because I, I remember I did this before. My car went under the map when I went in here. Oh, I can't really explain it because we literally got launched like halfway, halfway you from the turn. Well, okay guys, I think we'll have a little bit of a break here, and then we'll resume once I've got my Rhino tank. Bye! Okay guys, and we are back with some tank action, so let's get going. First thing I want to try out is... Oh, that kind of rejected me, I think. I tried to go in there and... 
Because the first time I did this in the tank, it totally glitched me out. Yes, yeah, yeah. Alright, I'm just gonna try and... It's not Look, quite working how Look, how it worked before. Right, let me get on top of it. Okay, I... Oh, I, I can oh, see God. this going down really, really bad. <laughs> this, this, this is... Oh god, this this has got to be the most fun I've ever had in GTA for like a long, long time. Oh yeah. Whoa! I just, I just saw you get launched there. That that was that's pretty crazy. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. I think I, I think it was Randy over there. Yes. Just because when we did this earlier, some really crazy stuff happened to me and Scott. I mean, like really crazy stuff. Yeah. I mean, just to let you know, we are on camera now, by the way. Yeah, I think you should get out of the tank and stand on top while me and Scott drive into the turbines. Yeah, that would be kind of good because then we can get it from a different perspective than just me driving into it. Well, like, I would first of all just like to try be being able to go underneath it because I've not been successful in what happened before. Morgan, let me drive. The... Right. Let me drive the tank. Right, I'm out of the tank, but I'm probably going to get shot, so better be quick. Oh yeah, I'm on fire. If you're gonna get in, you need to get in quick. I'm dead. Alright, so what are we doing now? Oh, are we gonna... Just careful with that tank. I'm, I'm kind of scared you're gonna kill me. I'm... Oh, I just fell off already. This is... This is not going to go down well. I, I've really got a really I'm good driving feeling. Slowly, no, yeah, no. driving slowly. Do not move the tank. Do not move the turret too much. Right, go. Oh, <laughs> slight dirt there. Whoa, I'm. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. If you guys just saw that on my perspective there, that was. Whoa! That, that tank just got launched. Alright, Scott, do you want to go? Yeah, I don't think this is quite gonna work. You can like put the tank here if possible, and then whoa. Um, yeah, that was pretty crazy. I love how you don't take much damage either when you're doing this. So, I've so got the right okay, I'm kind of stuck up here though. That's my parachute. Did you see that? Did you see that car? Yeah, I died. My parachute was like, I'm not working. <laughs> Alright, Corey, is my tank okay? It's beeping, but it's still alive. So that means it's just alive then? It's just about to die anytime soon. Alright then, let's go! Take- no, that didn't work. Take me to infinity and beyond. Nope, that didn't- nope, that did not want to work either. Whoa, I just- I just got crazy launched there. Whoa! What- what's going on with that tank? Oh, that is just crazy. Whoa, guys. Whoa, I just got double launched there. Oh wow, I'm, 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 I'm literally, I am at the top of the world, literally. Boom! Then look, when you, look, when you fall down though, guys, you don't, you take, for some reason, the damage is reduced. I think it's because of, in, in um, GTA 5, the game can't distinguish, like, why you got to that height. Because you didn't, it wasn't provoked, basically. So it sort of reduces the damage. I'm not 100% I'm not sure. I wonder how it would be if you combine this glitch with the flying Karuma glitch. Alright, oh, Corey, just, just come here, just stand right here, look, you get massively launched. That, that wasn't very massive, but it wasn't too bad. <laughs> well, I didn't, I didn't take any damage from that fall, that was pretty crazy. I'm gonna try and... Whoa, I, I did a sprinting one, wow. That was... I'm running as well, that's weird, I, I was running in midair. Boom. Uh, now I'm kind of stuck up here, because if I fall off, I'm going to die. All 
Right, Corey, so do you want, do you want to do a synchronised, like, jump up on that turbine, like what I was doing before? Now, just to sort of tell you guys, I'm sorry we won't be able to sort of, you know, you guys won't be able to do this glitch with us, basically, because, obviously, as far as I know, this is only in this session. So unless this is in other sessions, then, unfortunately, you won't be able to do this amazing launching. So, Corey, do you want to go over here? And just, so, it's right in this corner, basically, so I'll lead the way and then we'll both go. So just sprint at it, and then, hopefully... Now that wasn't very good at all, but I think you, you just have to get it at the get it at the perfect angle, and that's when you perfectly get that sort of launch. Oh whoa! I, I was just running by it then, and then I got like trampolined into the air. Yeah, I just jumped off the roof of the uh, Eclipse Towers into it. Oh, okay, and what happened? Yeah, I think if you get it at the right angle, you can catch both turbines, and then you get really high in the sky. Oh my god. Now, considering we're on Xbox 360, though, and not PC, I think this is pretty much as far as Xbox 360 modi modding goes, unfortunately. I mean, if anyone could mod this into like, the Like, oh, Corey, though, I believe you've been disconnected from the session. Oh, well, I guess that will have to be it for this episode then, I guess. Wait a minute. I think I'd... Who was that there? Just a quick I'll answer the video. I think I just saw Sapphire the Stripper in clothes. Come back here. I need you over here. You... You still in, still in the session? Oh, dear. Yeah, I'm still in the session. I'm just chasing this girl that looks like Sapphire. Okay, well, I'll, I'll join your session instead then, because uh, we're not in your session. Okay. Now I think we're just going to we're gonna do a couple more launches and then that is unfortunately going to have to be the wrapping up point of the episode, guys. As I don't really believe there's anything, anything more to the glitch. And, Corey, I've got some kind of bad news. What? The turbines have gone on my... Oh, nope. The turbines went there, now they've come back. That was really, really weird. They weren't there, and then they just suddenly appeared. Whoa! Maybe this will be the next sign glitch, what appears in everyone's sessions. Quite possibly. That would be kind of interesting to see if it's in the other sessions. Right, I've spawned right outside the apartment building, and let's go for a little bit of a jump. If you know what I'm talking about. Okay, I've this got isn't... a vehicle we could both get in if you want to do a vehicle one. Whoa! I, I, I got launched, like, pretty far then. I went sort of towards the crane over at the end of the road. Almost, I think the glitch works a lot better with, with the people, though, instead of cars. Whoa! We... We, 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 I just felt like we just got like, like um, like, like a hammer just hit our car or something, and was like, that's what the sort of smack down. That, that was that was pretty crazy. Whoa, that was weird. Oh, whoa, I was I was like climbing on top of the turbine then. That was pretty crazy. I think uh, I'm just going to come pick you up whenever you land. Okay, well I think, guys, I'm going to try and do one more landing and then I think we're going to have to wrap up the episode. So, Corey, do you want to do us another synchronised one to wrap up the episode? Um, okay. Alright, so just come where I am, Corey. Yep. Oh, whoa, what is happening? <laughs> You're kind of glitching a little bit there. So I think if you sort of run at it at this angle, then you get like the... Per yeah, I got whoa. That, that that was a pretty high up launch there. So, are you, are you in the air, Corey? Oh, I died. All right. Well, I think that kind of wraps up the episode, guys. Hope you've enjoyed. Goodbye from Peter Plum. Bye. And Howling Westy. And doing toast. Bye.